back six stringers it's bobby d here from don't fret guitar lessons i'd like to thank you all for stopping back and supporting the channel and learning this great instrument along with me and if you're new here i'm glad you found the channel i teach guitar songs for new players i will always have the lyrics up here with the chords above every word so you know when to switch today we're going to do a song called cruise by florida georgia line has four easy chords that are played throughout the whole song. Also, the strumming pattern, same strumming pattern throughout the whole song. All right, the song is in standard tuning. I have no capo on, but if you want to play the song the way the record is, put a capo on the third fret. Four chords are a G major, D sus two, E minor seven, and C add nine. Our G major, we're going to have our index finger, fifth string, second fret, our bird finger, sixth string, third fret, and our ring and pinky finger on the first and second string of the third fret. We're not going to remove them the whole song. Now for our D, sus2, don't be afraid. I know it sounds scary. Don't fret. It's easier to play than a D major. What we're going to do is... Remove our bird finger and bring our index finger down to the third string, second fret. Play down four strings down. So we're going to go up to an E minor seven. Again, don't fret. It's easier to play than an E minor. Leaving our pinky and ring finger locked. We're going to bring up our index finger, press on the fifth and four string, second fret. Play all strings. There's your E minor seven. If you can't do it one finger, just leave your index finger on the 5th string 2nd fret and drop the 3rd finger on the 4th string 2nd fret. Play all down. Here's your minor 7. Now to go to a C add 9, we're going to drop our index finger down 1 string to the 4th string 2nd fret and we're going to bring our 3rd finger over to the 5th string 2nd fret. Play 5 down. That's your C add 9. Now remember, when you play the C add 9, bump your finger now up against the sixth string. Just in case you hit that bottom string, it deadens it. All right. Now the strumming pattern is going to be down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. If you like to count it, like I do, I think it's a lot easier to learn strumming patterns. One, two, and and four. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go to my playlist and I have a lesson on strumming. All right, when we start out the song, we start out on a G and we're only going to strum once on the intro on each chord, one down strum. So we go, baby, you a song. And then we're going down to D. You want to make me roll my, then we're going to e, e minor seven, windows down, and then C at nine. Cruise. So it would sound something like this. Baby, you a song you want to make me roll my windows down and cruise. Just one strum. All right, then we go into the verse. Now we're going to use our strumming pat pattern. Down, down, up, up, down, up. And you come out singing, yeah, when I, and on the word I, with no chord, yeah, when I, and on the I, you hit a G. You start your strumming pattern. I'll slow it down for you. Yeah, when I first saw that bikini top corner, she's popping right out of that South Georgia water. Oh, 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 oh she had them long tan legs. 
Couldn't help myself, so I, she had nine, just one strong. Walked up and said, can we get to the chorus? Remember, same chords, four chords, same strumming pattern. Baby, you were something to make me roll my windows down. We get the verse two, same thing. Same chords, same strumming pattern. She was sipping on some singing Marshall Tucker, falling in love, the sweetheart of summer. Hopped right up into the cab of my truck and said, fired up. Remember, one C on this. Let's get this thing stuck. And then we go back to the chorus again. Same thing as the first chorus. Baby, you a song, make me want to roll my window down Cruise down a back road, blow a stop sign In the middle of every farm town with you All right, guys and girls, you got it. Same four chords, same strum pattern through the whole song. Now, the only difference is when you get down to the third verse, it's going to be one strum, just like the intro, when he says... I put it in park, grabbed my guitar, strummed a couple chords, and sang from the heart. That's it. Then you go into the strumming. Then we get to the outro, the last paragraph in the song. Baby, it was something that made me open my windows down and cruise. Come on, girl. Get those windows down. Hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you did, please like and subscribe. And remember, don't fret the small stuff till we meet you again. I God bless you. Adios.